welcome to today's vlog. Today we're up nice and early. I think it's about 10 o'clock, something like that. We were up early in that, obviously, but we're vlogging early. That's my point. Anyway, we're gonna just wait for Frank to come because he's coming to measure up. In fact, he's here now. He's coming to measure up because he's doing the gates for the landing. He's making like gates that lift up and out. I can't really explain what I mean. I'll show you once I'm done. But anyway, he's come to measure them up and then we're going to head to Asda and do some shopping. So yeah, anyway, we'll check back in shortly and then we'll be at Asda or wherever we decide to go. I'm not too sure. Okay guys, so Frank has been and gone home. We've come over to Asda now. Just going to have a look on the clothes aisle to see if we can see anything that I can pick up for the boys. Um, there is a pair of pants here that I wanted to get in, so I'll probably pick them up today. And I just can't help but look at the right baby stuff. Stuff. Just look at that. That's cute. But, yeah, I just took a little trip down the baby aisle because you just can't. Um, what you got there? Shoes? Yeah. <laughs> mm, I don't really like them. Oh, this got a bottle for bedtime. No. Yeah. No, I don't like them. Got them. I'll take them out when she's not looking. No. What, you're crashing? No. Yeah. These, have I'll you be. seen them? I really like them. I can. Them ones. Mm. These are the pants I was looking at. Material on them is so nice. And they're only £10. Okay, guys, a bit of a junk cut from Asda but anyway we managed to get all the shopping done we've got a nice fridge full of fresh food and stuff to prepare meals for the rest of the week unfortunately our fridge doesn't stay full for very long literally probably about a week and then we have to go shopping again but yeah anyway tonight we're having I think we're going to have puddings for tea. Puddings, mash, veg, potatoes, gravy. All the kind of like Sunday dinner things, but just not with the chicken. But yeah, I think that's what we're we'll having to eat tonight. We just had dinner. We had, um, we just got a meal deal for dinner. Because by the time we got back, it was like going to be nearly enough to a pot. So I just got my whole sandwich to drink and a bag of crisps. And we just all sat down and chilled and just talked. And like you anyway, as soon as we walk back in, Penelope got straight into her pyjamas, didn't you? That's what she always does. I don't know what's up with this camera, but it's looking a little bit red. I think that looks a little bit better, I just needed to sort it out. Um, but yeah, anyway, just got on, just going to chill out for a bit, boys. We're just having a go on the computer. Oh, what? Alfie's being mean to you. Alfie's being mean to you. Yeah, he said I'm not allowed to play. And he said I'm not allowed to play. And he said to Aurora, say ha ha. Yeah, he said The joys. The joys of having children. They just argue. Everyone always says, I bet it's hard work in the six weeks holidays. And he always saying, it's not actually that bad. But you know what? Maybe I'm lying a little bit. But, yeah, they do argue, they do fight. I think it's because we're in the same room all the time. It's not even like they can go and play out because it's not even sunny. Abby's here. Abby's here, Chloe's friend. She'll probably be here for the day. But yeah, I'm not so sure what I'm going to be doing today. I have got some things I need to get sorted in the house. I need to go upstairs and start finishing the boys' bedroom. I might do the painting later on tonight. But I really need to sort the, the smaller drawers out and put them into the drawers that are for the computer desk and sort a few other bits out and then a set of them drawers can go downstairs. And I'm not sure what I'm going to do with the other set of drawers yet. I do apologise for the racket in the background, but I can't find the remote to turn the TV down. So, but yeah, anyway, just want to check in and apologise that I did try and vlog in Asda, but the camera died and it's my fault because I knew that the battery needed changing and when I went out I just got to Asda and I thought sugar I forgot the battery so I need to start leaving a charger in the car and a battery so I've always got one with me but 
yeah, I need to head on over to the studio, hopefully in a bit, and I've got a couple of things that I need to get sorted and posted um, today. So I might go over there in a bit. I think Dave's gonna go first and I will go over. I'm not sure whether I'll get it posted tonight, it might be first thing in the morning, just because by the time Dave gets back, it might be a little bit too late. But yes, and then I've got some washing we need to sort out and I've got loads of things that need to be done. It's just really hard when all the kids are here to get every single thing done that I need to do. It was really good yesterday because I got most of the stuff done that I needed to do because Aurora was out with imaging, which was like a massive help. So, but yeah, anyway, I will see you soon. The following announcement has been paid for by the New World Order. Hi. Hi. So I'm going for something sweet. How old are you? What? 15. <laughs> Why my mum's for food? Just because we're starving. I'm gonna eat something to eat. Out of bush. Yeah. Watch what we get in, what we're gonna have. I don't know, because I don't know what they do. Never been. So nice. We had, what did we have called when we went? We had chicken ramen, I think it's called. And Chloe had chicken katsu curry, I think. But yeah. <laughs> we're gonna say hi now, seeing as we're in it. <laughs> Chloe just doesn't like being on camera unless it's her own. And then she loves it. So we're finally going for food after a delay on the train. Where are we going that way? <laughs> so finally here. And then get on this campo. Get on this one. So yeah. <laughs> We're gonna go for food. And then stop back. But yeah. Finally here. After waiting so long. So hungry. Yeah. <laughs> so guys, we're just in Wagamama. <laughs> <laughs> so Portia, are we waiting? Um, <laughs> Very, yeah, very nice. What did you have? I don't know what it's called. Katsu curry? Yeah. Chicken katsu curry. It's awful. Chloe, did you not want to say hi? <laughs> Come on, I'll get you both together. <laughs> it manages the city centre. Right, no, it's not for you. <laughs> Exciting! Woohoo! Double chin. <laughs> <laughs> just doesn't like, she's very camera shy. So after eating, we just decided to come in a little bit of a shop to, that we need to come on Primark. You know that we definitely need to come on one because we definitely don't. Because we just spent too much, what? It's got a top inside. Ooh, very snazzy. Snazzy. <laughs> No, I do actually like that to be fair, that's quite cute. Alright. Do you want that size? Yeah. So, <laughs> Chloe's just spending money, as per usual, that we don't need to spend. Um, but obviously, that's, that's Chloe for you. Chloe. Oh, yes. You that? Are you joking? No. <laughs> <laughs> Chloe being silly. Anyway. Being silly. Very silly. That's all Chloe's known for, is being silly. But yeah, other than that, um, We'll see you in a bit. <laughs> what do we think? Do we reckon a successful shopping trip? After buying things we didn't need? Chloe. Again. Again, that we didn't need. What do you reckon, Chloe. Bush? From here.
Quad drag and Porsche. Successful? <laughs> so, as a positive, we're still all sat here, waiting for the train. Taking the piss out of people's train. 100%. Giving the giving the opinion, giving the opinion on um good looking shoes. And why not? Nothing else to do. Kill time. Obviously. Waiting for the train. And then we're gonna have a girl sleepover. Just to make it a bit more cringier day. <laughs> yeah. But we all enjoyed food, yeah? Oh, yeah. We all had good food. Hang food. Beautiful food. Hang like Wagon Mamas in Manchester, 100% going for it. Alright, I think. We're getting full detail about it. The rifle's moist. What? <laughs> <laughs> Bit dry today. Bit and then dry. we just obviously did the shopping for our lovely weekend away. Again? The second one in the space of a week. Four days? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. What we're saying, we are ready to go home and have what? a party. What? So that we are ready to go home and have a party. More like go sleep. Watch Love Island. Party. Watch Love Island. Guys, who do we think is gonna be the who do we think is gonna be the winners of Love Island this year? Who's gonna win it? Yeah. Liberty and Jake. Liberty and Jake. Yeah, well main time when it was the people it was like saying it was like Chloe and Yeah, 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 yeah. That's yeah, that's probably who's going to win it, isn't it? No, I think well, probably you won't. Well, Lip and Jake deserve to win. That's what I'm saying. Yeah? Yeah. Yeah, yeah Mum. <laughs> Just people in general were all stunning. We've all got a half. Stunning. Beautiful. So good. All right, guys, as you just seen there, it was um, Abby, Chloe, and Portia that stole the camera and took it along with them to Agamamas. I think everybody should give Abby um, a big clap and a big round of applause for um, vlogging for the first time. I think she's a natural, so she should definitely pick up the camera and do some more. But um, yeah, we don't know. She might do, they might do when they go to Stoke on Trent. We might send Abby with one of the cameras so she can do some footage. And then we might put it in over the weekend. I'll speak to him and see how it went. And um, speaking of how things went, I actually had my whoa, this camera is all over the place. I think Sarah's put it into autofocus again, so it's having a hard time tracking my fat bulbous head. But um, speaking of you know having a rough time, I had the tattoo done today. It's um, finished. We've only got to do the bottom part of it now, where the bottom of his armor is just putting some whites in there and some darks. We're gonna go in next time and move around the leg, so where you've got the knee, my Mandalorian is on the outside. I'll try and get some footage for you in a minute if I can. Oscar's playing zombies at the minute, so it's a bit difficult to get him to do it while I'm, um, I'm vlogging this, and he usually gets pretty high on it with Mason, so it could be hours, so I'll try and do it myself. But, um, we're going to move around the knee into the inside like, and we're going to do Grogu next, which is Baby Yoda, of course. And then he's going to put some spikes in the background with some Stormtrooper helmets through it. Going to put some stars in there. It's just going to look badass when it's finished. It's going to go right up the leg as well, so um, it'll look pretty cool. Although I don't think it's going to go that high up the leg because I'm not that keen on having it done on the inside of my leg. I think that's going to absolutely murder. And if we do, it'll have to like be in bits about this big. Um, I, I, I don't mind admitting that I'll probably tap on that one. I haven't tapped on anything else before, so um, but I know that that's going to work. But saying that, I had my um, ankle done. It didn't hurt. I was surprised. 
Um, <clears throat> so yeah, he's going to be doing Grogu. I've got to pick some other characters as well. Yeah, I don't know which characters we're going to be having yet. I've picked like, um, I like, I want to have Carl Weathers on there, which is Grief Cargo. Definitely, I think the character is just amazing. Really, really like it. And he did direct one of the episodes as well. Yeah, I know I'm going to have on the other leg, we're going to go for the dark side, but obviously on this leg, we're kind of keeping it like Mando themed. So there'll be a few different characters in there. Um, I don't know. There's loads, there's loads to pick from, but obviously the main two are going to be Mando and um, Grogu. But I'm going to try and get some footage now, if I can, of what it looks like. So, I mean, as you can see, you can see bits of Mando there. It's still wrapped up. Um, he has put cracks in the helmet here and stuff, but it just looks, it's just badass. It really is, it's amazing. He is unbelievable. In my eyes, he's one of the best in the world, if not, no, top, at least top 10. He's, um, he's something else, but yeah. Um, there is nothing else to report apart from that. If there isn't, there's nothing else to report. There is, there is nothing else to literally report. We had the camera stolen by the girls. They put out like a pretty kick-ass vlog. I hope everybody's enjoyed it. I hope everybody gets behind the girls. I think Abby wants to set up her own channel as well. So if she does, we will definitely link her up. And um, and yeah, we'll help her get started. So on that bombshell of tattoos, characters, Abby, the girls, me, Sarah, as to being a disaster. Do not forget to smash the like button, subscribe if you're not already. Make sure you click the notification bell, it does nothing. Make sure you leave us a comment if you can and we will definitely see you guys tomorrow because we do this every single day.